Hey everyone, this is the Caffeinated Nerdy Geek again with my brother Cordier Mark. Hello. And guess what? We have another Loot Crate. Yay! Mm. Okay. Time to open. It's bigger than last time. Yeah, it so is. So I'm expecting something bigger. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. Alright. First Ooh. of all, off is Codsworth. The, your personal butler from Fallout 4, I believe it is. Yep, I think it, isn't that the thing that was cutting the cake at first? No, that's In on the... Fallout 3. On oh, yeah. Fallout 4, when you, when you birth your character, or with, before the, the nukes went off, the, mm -hmm. he's your personal butler alongside your spouse and your little baby. Okay. Cool. So, I'll have to take him apart. And, but he's also like um, the other two up there. He yep. has his own stand. Mm -hmm. So he has a stand. He has little things that clip onto him. We'll probably take him out and put him together for you later. But next we have... Look, here's a towel if I can get it out. A towel! Something useful for, for our bathroom or... Or vacations. Mm, yeah. It's not a very big one, but I do like a lot of the colors. Yeah. The Rockobots take the nation by storm. Ten number one hits, including carburetor, heart, something. <laughs> if you, I cannot read. To any <laughs> viewers who get the same game, follow up with Crate, and you can help us out. <laughs> yes, please. <laughs> Okay, next is next, next. another pin, pin of Fallout. A Robocall. Looks like he's mad or something. And according to this, it is a Nerd Rage pin. For pin. <laughs> nerd Rage, yep, sounds about right. <laughs> yep. That, that makes me think of you. Yeah. <laughs> and another poster, Mr. Handy. Man's best friend reinvented. <laughs> Alright. Maybe. Next up is our Pit Boy a traveling thing. thing. T shirts? No, keep away I... from small children. May cling to nose and mouth and prevent breathing. Zip the bag morning. Yeah, according to this, it's. What is it? Yep. Pit Boy luggage tag. Sweet. Sorry, I'm <laughs> At first, I thought it'd say Christmas ornament. Yeah, that would have been kind of cool. Yeah. I mean, we could probably do it. It's a rubber ornament, so. Yeah. Pit Boy! I know I just showed it to you, but there it is again. Mm -hmm. It's very cool. Right now, I can get this open. Is that the head? Or the upper torso? Nope. Doggy! Dog me. <laughs> That's the name of the dog. Dog me. German Shepherd. Yep, to go along with the power armor. Raise the back. I believe he goes with your main character at Fallout 4. Again, you have a right to correct us. <laughs> He's mine now. <laughs> <laughs> well, he goes with the power armor. Yeah, you get the power armor, I get the dog. <laughs> All right, still a no, deal. It's, it's okay. Alright, okay. last but not least, poster. We got posters. Ooh. A power armor poster. Let me see. Up, 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 up. That's sweet. I like that. We're going to have to get a frame for it and have it like either yes. like right up there. <laughs> yes. So we have a large Doctor Who poster on that wall, mm -hmm. a Star Wars canvas. So we need like power armor right there. <laughs> yep. Or we can use it as a display for like if we do get a corium or a terrarium, just use it as a background. I'm not sure about that one. Unless it's like tall wise, yeah. Because if it's this way, then you're gonna have to tilt the poster. I think the other one that you have, um, from the other loot crate would be good for that kind of tank. Yeah. But also, we didn't show you this from the last box. You can take these and turn them inside out, like so. You have that printed, but then you take the inner flaps, open them up, turn it over. And with a little minor engineering, which I have not had. Nor a degree. <laughs> yeah. So you turn it inside out, fold those okay. in. Hang on, I'm 
got to just try to help them. Yeah. There's a slot here that you just have to meet up there. Okay. And it comes out. Yeah, the other one. There we go. Okay. Now it's starting to make more sense. Yeah. So when you have all the other loot crates, mm -hmm. you can have them so they're assembled. Like I still have the one with the girl mm -hmm. and the other um, Fallout box yep. one. So you can just assemble them so you have the different characters from Fallout. Okay. And you can color them, paint them. Hmm. So. Okay, I guess yeah. I learned something. Yeah. <laughs> actually, I think you can do it with all the crates, actually. So. All right. Because I know you, that's what you do with, um, like, the Infinity Gauntlet that I have. Yeah. And I think you can do it with the Marvel ones. I don't know for certain. Hmm. But. Okay. Is that everything? Yep, that's all. Okay. Rating. Five out of ten, or mm. one out of ten, sort of thing. Like, how would you? I like the doll. Yeah. And also the poster. Yeah, the poster was really good. That almost looks like um, almost a Halo kind of atmosphere. Yeah. Like it's dark. Mm-hmm. Well, it it sort of looks steampunkish too. Like. Yeah. I mean, it's not as high tech as Fall. I mean, um, as Halo. Yep. But it does have like the aesthetic of either mm -hmm. steampunk or, um, yeah, I'm going to have to say steampunk or Pacific Rim kind of thing where it's yeah. kind of a gritty color. Mm -hmm. I didn't realize that dog meat was right there. Yeah. Yeah, dog meat is like looking right up at the power armor. So, mm -hmm. okay. But I'm so excited. <laughs> yep. Okay. So, anything you like? I do like the dog meat toy thing wherever he went. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I know I just had him, but I thought I put him. Oh, there he is. I did put him down. Like, I put it, like, right there. Um, but I also like the luggage tag. Mm -hmm. And let me just pull out dog meat. I want to see. Oh, he's kind of a rubbery. Mm -hmm. Well, not rubbery because you can't really bend him. Like, there. Nope. That's a pretty solid one. But he is so cute. He looks a lot like, um. Or he reminds me a lot of Rin Tin Tin. He's kind of small for a German Shepherd, though. Yeah. He's very <laughs> cute, though. <laughs> I like it. I would say this pin. <laughs> the pin fits. <laughs> fits Rachel's profile. Do you think? <laughs> yeah, I uh, got me started on something like, um, Mark can testify to this, but I get into a rage when someone messes up my favorite series. Like, uh, they had Sherlock Holmes versus Dracula. Needless to say, I was not thrilled. So, um, yeah, apparently I'm an angry nerd. <laughs> <laughs> Forget it about angry bird, it's angry nerd. Mm, yep. <laughs> ah! Or nerd rage. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, nerd rage. So, nerd rage. <laughs> so, consider it my gift to you. Oh, I thank you. <laughs> so... What mood are you in today? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So if anyone Nerd is rage. asking you how your day is going, you can just point at your pin. Well, actually, that would look pretty good on the Nintendo backpack. Yeah. I think, like, mm -hmm. between the um sort of grayish thing and then the gold. Yep. That would look really cool. Yeah. I'm not trying to be selfish. I, yeah. And you have, yeah, most of the pins. So it's yep. Like... Yep. And I, I thought with that pin, it surely fits yeah. you. Yeah. <laughs> so... I'm trying to figure out what we should do with this one, because this could work on the back of the tank, too. Yeah. <laughs> Don't you think? <laughs> Just have, like, a little um, gray area sort of thing, and it looks like Mr. Handy walking the dogs, and whatever pet you have in there. <laughs> Mr. Handy. Maybe. Floating advertisement. <laughs> or, no, what you should do is, um, if you take, like, an old frame or something, make it look like a billboard sort of thing mm -hmm. on yeah. the back of the tank. Mm -hmm. So it looks like either the fish or something is swimming around in front of a billboard. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so it's like an advertisement with fish that swimming around like that. <laughs> All right. So, but I do like this luggage tag. That's yeah. like even the detail. If mm -hmm. you don't mind me taking it out, so we can show them. No, I don't mind at all. Okay. Um, because it's a rubber tag. Mm -hmm. I could tell it. Just by bending it and stuff. Ooh, the cord is pretty durable. Like, it's also a rubber... Yeah, screensaver went up, sorry. Um, 
So yeah, Pip Boy, Peg. It's pretty cool. Like I'm trying to see how you get. Oh, it's right here. So oh. you get this tag. Oh, okay. You pull it out. Oh wow, that's so yeah. Cool. So you have the name, email, and phone, and then you just slip it back. Yeah. And like that. I mean, at first glance, when you take the uh, card out, it almost looks like um, Halo kind of stuff. Like, you know, kind of like the Warthog kind of thing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And I will say some of the plastic has already started to come out, but if you sort of push it back in, it's no big deal. Okay. Like, it's, it's just a little lip. Mm -hmm. And I might have pushed it too far back with a card sort of thing, but... Yeah, so see plastic doesn't cover down there. Oh, yeah. So you can just tuck it back in the lip. So that's, it's no big deal. Yeah. I can't complain. You just have to, like, print really tiny. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, this is how big the lines are. <laughs> so, yeah. Yeah, unfortunately, my my handwriting is a little big. <laughs> that's where I can help you. <laughs> so, yeah. But, yeah, I would, like, if I were to use this on luggage, I would probably replace I mean, this is kind of durable, mm -hmm. like it's not going to tear easily, yep. but I would have like either a keychain kind of chain mm -hmm. on it. Okay. But yeah, because I think this would, it's not going to rip off easily because it's kind of thick and it's a sturdy rubber. Yep. But I'm just saying like you might have to find some other way mm -hmm. of securing it. So. Or but that's can, a pretty decent tag. Yeah. Like, or you can use it as rubber. a Christmas tree ornament. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> Merry Christmas! <laughs> Fallout. I like Christmas. Team, team Christmas tree. Well, we do have, let's see, Snoopy, Kylo Ren, and Yoda. Yeah. So we can easily just make a whole... <laughs> Last year we tried to make a fandom-themed Christmas tree. Yeah. It didn't get very far yet. <laughs> no. So, but it's working claim progress. your loot. Alright, I claim the poster. And keep in mind you can claim these two, so... Towel. Okay. You can have... This. Yay! <laughs> and so to upset you, but I think this goes with the power armor. Yeah, but you I, can. <laughs> I will share. Okay. And Codsworth. I can, okay. I can. Do you want to assemble him before we sign off? Sure. So the viewers can see. Right. I still think this would be kind of funny on the back of a fish tank. <laughs> yeah. Mr. Handy. Or or those who are watching has the same loot crate Abe, who owns pets, whether it's fish or or a terrarium type of animal. Maybe you can use those for your background. Or you can even have them like um, in the room, like if you have dogs or something. Yeah. You can frame it and have it sort of as a joke. Like, with all the leashes and stuff of the dog. Mm -hmm. So it's like, you have this up over the leashes. You know? <laughs> <laughs> well, because we're not saying that we're violent toward animals and stuff, but we oh. have had, um, we grew up with dogs. Yep. And they love to go for walks, and they were always in danger of getting into traffic. So we had to have them on a leash. We have one dog that loves it. She wears it as though it's diamonds. <laughs> <laughs> She's adorable, but she just loves her leash. All right, so we have a head. I'll hold it up close. And they have like a little flame mm -hmm. thing down there. Sort of keep it in the air. Yep. Arm. It's actually kind of heavy, actually, if you hold it this way. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's not heavy this yeah. way. It's about as much as, almost feels like a golf ball kind of weight. Yeah. Like a, either a tiny softball or a golf ball mm. kind of thing. So. Right. Arm number one. Also. Arm. He holds a coffee pot. Arm. This is what I need every morning. <laughs> yeah. That's what we need, Mr. Handy. Yep, Mr. Our, Handy. In our apartment. <laughs> okay, so and I'm just going to leave. Arm number two. Looks like a little blaster thing. Right. It's supposed to be ketchup. Yeah, it's ketchup and mustard, the red and yellow. Okay. Okay. And arm number three. That's a circular saw. Yep, I saw Louie. Yeah. I need more wood. <laughs> For those who watch 
much the toy that saved Christmas Veggie Tales, you'll definitely understand. <laughs> you understand that reference. But, and last but not least, a vault stand. Yep, pretty much the same as last time. Mm -hmm. And let's see. I think. Unfortunately, it doesn't come with instructions. Yeah, mm -hmm. I think it's like a. Well, I'm just praying you don't mess this up because it's like a oh boy. <laughs> How many legs did they? There's three legs. Rachel, how, did, how in the world do you mess up three legs? <laughs> it's definitely not a tripod from the world of the worlds. <laughs> yeah. I still haven't gotten very far in that book. I need to borrow it again from the library or buy my own copy. Yep. I think I do. Let's see. Yeah, that one. This one goes here. Oh, goodness. <laughs> they go in tight. Why am I thinking of a Han Solo quote? No! That, that one, one goes, goes there! there. This one goes, goes there! there. Got you got it! <laughs> <laughs> I love Han Solo. <laughs> okay, I think this one goes here. Maybe. I'm trying to make sure. Let's hope and pray. <laughs> Ninja, it does. It looks like it does. Is it like... Okay, so each arm has like a little... Um... A unique kind of yeah, I'll show you that one. Piece thing up here. Like almost like a screwdriver kind of thing. Like a certain kind of head. And the mission, should you, should you decide to accept it, is to fit it into this tiny little hole. <laughs> <laughs> Cramming it in there. <laughs> so uh some of them just don't want to go in there. Some pieces are stubborn. <laughs> Hang on. She has a knife. <laughs> I'm going to help her. <laughs> I just don't want you, the viewers to see if I break it. <laughs> if you're breaking your paint, it. <laughs> Mark, I have clear nail polish. <laughs> I can easily break it. <laughs> now they all know. <laughs> <laughs> this is hard. Alright. Final piece. I'm just waiting for the arms to automatically fall off. Piece of resistance. We, there we go. Yay! We did it. So now we have three different ones of these. Mm -hmm. I don't know what we're going to do if we keep getting more. Like We're going to have to get like a shelf or something. Yeah. Or maybe. Because we're running out of room on the TV. Mm-hmm. Because we have parts of the power armor up there. Mm -hmm. The two figures. And now this guy and the dog. <laughs> well, thank you so much for watching, guys. And yep. hopefully we'll have another unboxing video soon. So, yep. all right. Well, have a good night and stay caffeinated. Good yep. night. Good night.